Hello everybody, welcome to TechLore. Today I'm gonna to show you five dank freaking awesome free apps from the Google Play Store, which I think everyone should give a shot. I will leave all the links to every app listed in the description. Without further ado, let's kick off the video. The very first application today is called TempMail. Whether you're a privacy freak or Mr. I use password as my password, nobody likes spam mail or having to sign up for a service just for a quick thing you need to download. With TempMail, you can easily generate temporary email addresses to authorize and create new accounts with a service. The uses for this are honestly endless and the app gives you everything you need in one easy to use location. Here's how it works. Open the app and done. When a service sends an email to the fake address to authorize an account, TempMail will display it below. To generate a new one, you click change. Don't get too carried away now. This next app, which I hope you guys have heard of, is super simple, but arguably the most important one on my phone. Google Authenticator offers a much more secure way to start using two-factor authentication on services online. SMS two-step verification has proven to be extremely insecure in the past, and Google Authenticator is the solution. It is continually generating keys that you have to type into a website rather than the website sending one to you. It is much more secure and many websites online already offer support for it. It's only gonna expand in the future. App number three for the month is called Summary Scanner. Summary Scanner does a couple cool things. First, it will allow you to take a picture of anything and convert it to text on your phone. So if you have your essay, you can take a picture of it and convert it to text to send it to people on your phone. The second major feature offered is the summarizer tool, which will automatically shrink down everything to just get the major points. It's by no means a perfect feature, but Summary Scanner is still early in development, so it'll be interesting to see where that goes in the future. Next up is SD Made. If you guys don't know this already, never get cleaner apps on your Android devices or RAM boosting apps applications, none of that crap. Nine out of 10 times, they're doing much more harm than good. One of the very few exceptions to this rule is Greenify, which I've talked about in another video, and SDMade. SDMade has tons of features, a file explorer, file searcher, app manager, but the biggest one, which is the free feature, is the cleaner. It is one of the few legit and safe cleaners out there. Just click scan, click run now, and it's that simple. They do have a pro version, but the free has pretty much all the things you really need. And now for the fifth and final app of the month. I've never featured an app like this before ever on my channel. I like to offer cool feature filled apps with unique uses to them. But this is the hippie app. Ecosia, Ecosia, Ecosia browser, however you guys want to say it. It is a super standard browser with no cool features whatsoever. But what's so special, TechLore? Well, it's the logo. It's beautiful. In all seriousness though, this app is pretty dope because it lets you plant trees with your web searches on the go. Ecosia or Ecosia is a search engine and this is their app which uses the search engine as a default. They use a huge chunk of the ad revenue from their search engine to help make the earth a little bit better of a place. So hey, if you love trees and you want more of them to hug, this is a great way to do that. Also, don't forget that lemurs love trees and lemurs are going extinct. Therefore, if you get more trees, you get more lemurs and we need to plant more trees. That's going to finish our list. I hope you guys enjoyed some of these apps that I selected for you. And as always, don't forget to leave your favorite apps in the comments to potentially be featured in the next video. If you're into all that online security, cryptocurrencies, and all other things tech, make sure to subscribe to TechLore for more videos in the future. We just recently hit 10K and we can keep that momentum going. Don't forget to follow me on my social media. Don't forget to check out the website. And that wraps up the video. Have a freaking lemuricious day, everybody. Techlore is out.